Hey Fashion TV, this is Laurent Philippon. We are in the backstage of the Manish Aurora show here in Paris. We are in the Zen world, but of course the Manish way. So we are doing a uh, top knot. Uh, we're drawing lines and we're drawing lines in the bun itself. It's a bit like in the Kyoto Zen gardens. We're using Bumble and Bumble Sumo Wax that helps us drawing those lines. We heat it up with the dryer, then we're using a very uh, large tooth comb and then we're just like sculpting those lines in. Then we're just knotting it a bit like a sumo wrestler, you know, with a cord. And then we're creating spikes with the ends. Hi, my name is Yusta and we're in the backstage of Manish Aurora. It's like super sumo, also with the sumo wax, like traditional bags that they're supposed to use. Yeah, that's cool, I think. Hi, Fashion TV. My name is Alisa Grubavai, Kiss You, and we're on the backstage in Manish Aurora. <laughs> Hair is very great, it's some, but it's like so hard, I think, to take this off after. <laughs> We'll see. Hello, Fashion TV. I'm Kabuki. I'm at the Manisha Aurora Show. It was inspired by a Zen garden. So there was a feature of that in the embroidery. In fact, the whole collection is inspired by Zen. And uh, we wanted a certain uniformity, almost like uh, Buddhist monks, to the models. And I also thought that the white would offset the brilliant orange, which is in the collection, kind of a dominant color. I created the design with a pencil on somebody's face, and then I made an imprint of that to get from the curve to the flat. And then we created the stencil from that, the original stencil was hand cut, but then we created 20 of them, because it took me an hour to cut for one face, so then we, got, we could laser cut. I hope we get the uniformity that we desire. Hi Fashion TV, I'm Mariana and we are the backstage from the Paris Fashion Week. I'm really impressed. When I came here, I didn't know I'm gonna have such a makeup. I never had anything like this before. And it was like so interesting the way they made it. It's hard to find something similar to this. I'm really impressed, I like it a lot. I think it's very extraordinary. I mean, this is my first show with such like amazing, very cool makeup. Like a glitter, the white face. Very cool, I think. I look like Japanese and it's so, so funny, I like it. I like that it gets that kind of like, you know, sumo, also geisha look, you know, super Japanese. I love that actually. Fashion TV, I'm Manisha Rora and welcome to my fashion show. Well, I was inspired more with spirituality first. Japanese was a context for various reasons. Also, I learned a lot about it. It was a deep research in terms of conversations with friends and people I know who have uh, experienced it themselves being a monk and uh, so that, those stories with me following also a spiritual path 
for last eight nine months. It was a mix of all that. I'm from India, so I always have a huge amount of workmanship in my clothes. If I would not do that, I'll be silly. So that is my strong point always. When you talk about spirituality or you talk about meditation, there's a lot of concentration, a lot of effort going in it emotionally. And that's the kind of effort I want to express in clothing. So which means a lot of workmanship, a lot of precision, a lot of uniformity. A lot of the embroideries and the face makeup was taken by the sand art that they make uh, in the monasteries. really colorful they use some bright nice colors I'm gonna have like trousers and kind of long short it's very nice Super colorful look, like uh, so all the collection colorful, but yeah, it's like four layers of clothes. They have bright colors and all the sparkle on them. Uh, it's a Chinese emoji. In fact, I told them I want to work with them and uh, they were surprised because I saw that emoji once, somebody forwarded to me and I fell in love with it. It was such a simple uh, character with so many emotions and then I thought, why can't we imagine Tushki living my own life? So that's how the story is in the, in the collection. It's about all the things I do is what Tushki is doing. the dress so very amazing very extraordinary as well I love that orange is the color of not just monks orange is the color of spirituality it's a color even in India saints uh, wear orange. It's, it's a very common color amongst uh, people who are spiritually inclined. I'm gonna have like dress and also like sweat on the top which is like nice combination it's something brand new I would say I'm also very excited of this The 
idea was to show embroideries but not be so in your face about it. Yet, I am a show off person, I love to show off. So we wanted to open the net when they're walking. Yeah,